Here's a reminder. When you reach your goal weight, that's air quotes there, by the way, you're not finished. This is the Gary Cantrell Podcast. Yes, this is something I definitely wanted to touch on here today. A little short and sweet action for you. Something that I posted over on Instagram. And if you're not following me, how do you even know about this podcast? Actually, I'm genuinely curious. Let me know. Gary's podcast at gmail.com. But anyway, this is what I posted about today. When you reach your goal weight, you're not finished. It's really simple, folks. You don't want to be another statistic. You don't want to fall into these uh, traps like I have fallen into myself. Now, you may remember a couple of podcasts ago, I talked all about this, where I gained back 30 pounds out of the 100 plus pounds that I lost. And I gained back those 30 pounds over the course of two years. Because I thought, well... Partially because I thought I was done. And the other part of it was like, you know, I felt like I was on this, uh, on this victory lap. Like, yeah, I did it. I'm done. What's there left to do? Well, in fact, there is a lot left to do, by the way. Because you're never really finished. I mean, finish is not even, should not even be in the vocabulary. Because... There's nothing to finish. Now, look, when you put the number at the forefront, all right, yeah. In that context, you might think that you're quote unquote finished. But what this journey is really all about is changing habits. Something that I'm still working on, obviously. But that's what the real point of all this is. It's not to... um, seek out this number. The number is part of it. Don't get me wrong. You can't take it out of the equation and still call it weight loss, obviously. But putting it at the very, very front and making it the sole purpose for your kind of, you know, thing is is just not, it's not the way you want to go about it. You want to have this purpose where You're trying to change your life for the better. You're setting up these new habits. And by setting up these new habits, it sets up everything else along the way. You know, you're not, uh, you're not reaching for all the junk food and not exercising instead junk food here and there because we are human, but you are exercising. You're moving more. You're drinking that water. You're doing a lot of different things. And slowly but surely, your habits change. I mean, like, look at me. I And again, I can only speak for me. And the people that come on this podcast as a guest can only speak for them. While I will not claim to fully have my quote unquote shit together, what I will tell you is I'm in a much better spot than I was before because I'm not looking at this as like a three to five year play. It's my whole life play, so to speak. And the fact that I lost over 100 pounds and then I gained some of it back, this is just part of all this. It's just part of this continual journey that is called life. And along the way, habits are changing. Not everything is perfect, obviously, but I'm figuring it out. So the whole point of all this, because I want to keep this short and sweet, And I probably, honestly, I probably articulated it better in my caption over on Instagram. So maybe you want to go read that. But uh, it's really what it comes down to is, yes, the number is a part of it. But it's not the entire story. You have to factor in everything else. How you're feeling mentally and physically. How your clothes are fitting. Looking at differences in photos. And yes, if you're not taking photos, take the damn photos and know I'm not saying put them all over social media if you're not comfortable with that, but take them for yourself so that you can watch this unfold right in front of your eyes. Weight loss, yes, is about losing weight. 
but that number on the scale at the end of the day is just, it's a number. And it's part of a number of things that you have to focus on as you're making these life changes. So don't be like Gary. Don't reach one of these numerical base goals and then say, ha ha, victory lap, I'm done. You're really just getting started. 